Hi everyone. Um, just checking in because I haven't posted for a few days. Um, been super busy working on um, this project in North Shields, um, which has been really enjoyable, but um, quite hard work. And um, yesterday, um, I've been basically I've be, I've had some help. Um, Andrew, who is one of my besties husbands is exceptionally good at DIY painting so he's like my right hand man he's been working there with me the two of us have been beavering away on these um two show apartments um anyway basically yesterday we were moving a piece of furniture and um stupidly I was wearing Birkenstocks and didn't have proper shoes on and as the sofa moved backwards, it ripped the entire large toenail, my big toenail, off my foot. So as you can imagine, that was rather painful. Um, it was like literally hanging on by a bit of skin. Um, sorry for anyone who's squeamish. I am, by the way. So um, Andrew hot-footed down the corridor, got a pair of scissors and yes i had to cut it off so basically i've now got no big toenail at all i have lost toenails before um but m mainly you know when i've been training for iron man so it doesn't really hurt that much they just sort of like die off and it's fine um anyway the most painful part by far was the visit to the pharmacist um after I dropped Andrew at his house, I went to the health hut, who, to be fair, the pharmacist was absolutely amazing. Um, I got seen straight away, but the disinfectant spray was rather sore. And then um, he started rifling around in a drawer full of metal implements and then produced a scalpel so I'm sitting there basically trying to be brave because Freddie's stood right next to me and I don't want him to think that his mum's an absolute pussy. So I, at this point I had to look away because I'm really not good with stuff like that. And actually that wasn't too bad, but the worst bit by a country mile was when he put iodine directly onto the nail bed, which was basically like an open wound. Oh my dear God it absolutely knacked like obviously not as bad as childbirth or breaking your foot but it was really sore anyway um we've been back there at um at the apartments today just basically getting finished off and um really pleased with how everything's turned out i've shared a few photos on my woodcock interiors page um this afternoon and the professional photos um i should have next week also getting professional photos of the other job which I've been doing, which is basically the total other end of the market. So that they're getting done tomorrow as well, which is really exciting. So there's lots of really exciting stuff happening at work. However, um, I'm not sure what's going to happen with training. My toe is still very sore, as you can imagine, and I'm hobbling on it at the moment. I'm hoping that once the sort of sort of rawness has gone off it i might actually be able to get a trainer on and maybe consider doing some running i don't know i really don't know how long it's going to take because i've never lost a toenail in this way before um so i'm pretty annoyed that i've done it but um i'm trying to remain optimistic we go to the lakes at the weekend and we were hoping to try and do cat bells with freddie don't know if that's going to be possible hoping that i can just sort of pack it up a bit and my walking boots are actually probably a little bit too big so actually that's probably gonna work in my in my favor a bit um i'm just really annoyed with myself that i've done it like literally a few days before we go on holiday um not the first time it happened when i broke my foot that was like the day before we went on holiday or two days before we went on holiday as well Honestly, what an idiot. What an absolute idiot. Um, on the plus side, I've 
had my hair hair done, so my horns are no longer ginger. They're just they're still horns, but they're blonde horns now, so that's good. These bits at the front, I don't know why, are always more ginger than the rest of my hair. Anyway, that's really boring for you guys. So yeah, I just wanted to check in and uh, let you all that's, know that's what the crack is. That's what's been going on. I did manage to do a bike on Monday, which was. Um, uh, 50 minutes I think it was um, burned about 500-ish calories something like that So, and then went and had my hair done by um, Claire who is just mind hairdresser of the year every time love her, absolutely love her not that you can see the style of it but I haven't really had anything done with it I was going to get it chopped off into a bob but then I just decided I still wanted to be able to tie it up so I'm going to wait until next time when I've lost a bit more weight and I feel my face is a bit thinner because I think then I'll be ready to get my bob back again. Anyway, um, I better go because um, I need to sort Hattie out. But um, I'll check in again um, nearer to the weekend um, and let you know how my toe, big toe recovery is going. What an idiot. Um, I hope everyone's having a good week. Thanks for the support again. Speak to you soon. Bye.